You know, even after I've served 40 years in the Army, you know, I knew I could still learn from a PFC who maybe had one year experience because they might have been at the, the tip of the spear. They're more familiar with their weapon system than I would ever be. They, are, they might be more familiar with a, with a particular vehicle than I'm going to be familiar with because in my level that I'm at, I'm not doing maintenance on a vehicle anymore, right? So again, you could, you could be mentored by anybody in your organization, regardless of their education level, regardless of their time on the job, because they may have some life experience that kind of is going to provide some mentorship to you that has nothing to do with the particular industry that they're in. So don't close your eyes to people just because they don't have the education that you have. Maybe they don't have the experience that you have. I believe we could learn from anyone no matter the case. And you provide a great story in your book about Brian Cranston. He was on the Seinfeld episode. He was getting ready to do his scene. Uh, he was a dentist, going to work on uh, Jerry Seinfeld's mouth in this scene. And he looked up and he saw a maintenance man replacing a light bulb fixture on the ceiling. And the man suggested that if Brian, as a dentist, took a whiff of the nitrous oxide first, the scene would be much funnier. And Brian took that advice and the scene became one of the most memorable in the history of the show. So like you said, mentorship is everywhere. We simply have to be open in receiving it.